Hindustani Shafa Khana fails to climax. Let's talk sex, says director Shilpi Das Gupta, and then goes on to make such a gross film that you'll go celebrate for the next few days. Baby Vedi peddles medicines as a medical representative and muffs it up quite unfunnily most of the time. Humor, according to Das Gupta, is in baby baby mouthing woefully low grade dialogues like potty being mixed with mud to make unbreakable pottery. That one line should be enough to gauge that the entire film is like dysfunctional love making, disappointing, and dreadfully unable to climax. Her mother is the orthodox Punjabi parent who's forever alternating between parathas and pictures of prospective sons in law for her daughter. There's a son around too who does precisely nothing except to be an annoying presence in the screenplay. Baby Bedi wears an eternal frown. The medical rep is either attempting to bluff her way through an unsuccessful sale or she's confronting a relative who wants to turf them out of the outhouse where they live. It's up to Baby Bedi to repay a huge loan and mounting expenses. Don't ask questions like why such an utterly orthodox family would encourage the son to laze around while his sister goes around on a scooter trying to take care of all their bills. And then one day, Baby Bedi gets an inheritance. One more frown for her. Should she accept the legacy of a sex clinic from her dead mama ji and save the family from its financial woes? or please the old fashioned folks around her who treat the word sex like it's a disease the plot had so much potential but with a screenplay that's as dull as a honeymoon without romance topped with excruciating dialogues khandani shafakhana doesn't quite perform like it should have one was all set for a charming small town film but the overtly punjabi film has none of the robustness of the community and fizzles out during the foreplay itself Ultimately it's neither a sex comedy nor an engrossing family drama. Its biggest failure is that its outdated silliness kills even the basic intent of the film, the social message of how imperative sex education is. Sonakshi Sinha as Baby Bedi sincerely tries to carry the film on her shoulders, but the dullness of the screenplay and direction are a burden. Kulbushan Karbanda as the dead mama ji who keeps turning up in flashbacks soon begins to look like a ghost you can do without. Priyanshu Jora as Lemon Hero, the guy with fizz who provides a whiff of romance in Baby Bedi's life is pleasant. The presence of popular rapper and musician Badsha who turns up stealthily for his medicines for non-performance caters to the Punjabi in the audience. For a film that's neither grippingly told nor entertains, Khandani Shafakhana gets a 2-star rating. <laughs>